What up, everybody? It's your girl, July, from Kickback Couture. Today, I'm going to talk about a parallel compressor I've been using heavily in my mixes. It's created by Baby Audio, and it's called I Heart New York. I love New York. So, I have a couple examples, one in Ableton and a few in Reason. So, I'm just going to do Ableton first. Now, my kick drum is lacking for me, and if I turn it up, it doesn't do much justice other than just making it louder now this kick just is lacking in a lot of areas in terms of punch mostly I'm um, getting the boom for my 808 so I just needed to punch through and it's not doing that and when I turn it up I do have a side chain to the 808 but I shouldn't have to have it that loud in order for, you know, for the transients to come through. So I'm going to use this parallel compressor here. A parallel compressor is essentially, um, it takes a copy of the, the original signal and it compresses that copy and then you mix it into the original signal. Now every compressor has a different tone, so each compressor will sound different when you do this when you initiate a parallel compression in any instance I said the same words in different ways whatever I hope that made sense so I'm gonna turn the spank up and in order to hear what's going on I need to raise this level here of the parallel signal Let's go drastic. Now in addition to this spank parallel signal fader, we also have the output and the solo I just pressed. I am hearing a slight click at the end of my sample, so I'm going to fade it out much better. All right, let's go ahead and get this slightly come into this red mark i don't want it to be too heavy maybe heavy for this style we'll see let's start to mix it in My next steps would be checking the sound in my monitor. So I'm gonna do that and I'll be right back. So I think that sounds incredible. Let's A, B, before and after. This is before. And after. Now we immediately got some punch in here. Okay, so now I'm in Reason and I have a sample style B and I would like to add punch to this kick as well so let's play this now this one is pretty punchy as well so i may retract that statement and let's just use iheart new york 
for tone. So I'm going to create a instance of it, baby audio, I heart in Y. I love New York. <laughs> All right, cool. Let's get this spank on. I think that's a good level. For hip hop, you can ultimately push it, but you don't want it to sound like too much, too much like crap. I think that's good. Let's mix it in. See how I added that punch to our sound? That punch might be what you're going for and not just, you know, a uh, great, great sound selection is important, but this punch is very crucial. So let's go ahead and mix this in context. All right, I'm gonna check my monitors and then I'll be back. All right, I love it, it's awesome. Now, another thing I often use parallel compression for is my instrument bus or my vocal bus. Now, this is something I picked up from a few producers actually, but I actually, the one I remember is mixed by Ali who mixes Kendrick Lamar's tracks and I want to show you that process. So what I'm gonna do is take these two samples. I'm gonna route them to a new bus here in Reason. And I'm gonna right click and I'm just gonna, so I named my bus and now I'm gonna right click it again and I'm going to create a parallel channel. You don't necessarily have to do this because it creates a copy of the signal for you within the plugin, but I do it this way because I have more control over my final output volume. So I'm gonna smash this to pieces and then mute this, turn it down. So what it's gonna do is basically give it a fuller sound and add the color of the compressor. So this is without it. And this is with it. Without it. With it. And we can even add our bass into this bus and see how it reacts. Let's go ahead and route this to the same bus. Without it. With it. So there you have it. I Heart NY by Baby Audio. It's great for adding punch to your drums. You can use it on kicks, snares, anything you want to get punch out of, even 808s. And you can do what I just did and create an instrument bus. I do this on vocals all the time and mix it in. Gives them more body, makes them sound fuller. Definitely experiment with it. I will drop the link down in the description. It's all culture, kickback, and cook up.